so why don't you give me a ticket? And I'd be like, meeting of where am I city of Oxford Board of Zoning Appeals for Tuesday April 23rd 2024 uh, do we have attendance I guess we don't really need yeah. to um, I'm the would you like me to call the roll yes could you call the roll please thank I you I will <laughs> Mr. Conrad here <laughs> Mr. Smith here Mr. Wyatt here Mr. Russo present Ms. Ruminier here um, so the, uh, the first thing I want to say is that I'm acting chair, which is why I'm hesitating a bit here. I was vice chair. I'm now acting chair. I just want to say a bit about Roger Ames, who was chair for the last, I think, two years and served for nine years on Board of Zoning Appeals. Uh, served valiantly. He was a great colleague all the time I've been on Board of Zoning Appeals. And I'm very sorry he's gone. His third, th his terms, he was about to be term limited off, but he also seemed to have other more important things to do. So we miss you, Roger. Um, he was very judicious. He knew the rules well. He was a great colleague in so many ways. Uh, so we miss him as chair. As vice chair, I am now acting chair until we have a swearing in later on tonight, right? So the first order of business is the election of officers and swearing in of BZA members, correct? And first, swearing in of BZA members. We're going to do that first? If you'd like. Okay. Ben, can you undo that? Okay. Come on out. <laughs> you can do it. Well, do it in the group. Do it on mass. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. We have the oath in front of us. Very here, good. So. Okay. I okay. state your name. All right. So uh, if you'll go ahead and, and stand yes, okay. and raise your right hand, we'll all, all of us will repeat together. Okay. I'll start and then you'll repeat after me. I. 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 Calvin Conrad. Matt Wyatt. Kate Ruminier. Bill Russo. Donald Chadwick Smith. I solemnly swear. Solemnly, solemnly swear, swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will, that support, will support the Constitution, the Constitution of the United, United States. States. And of the state of Ohio, and, and of the, the state, state of Ohio. Ohio, and will obey the laws thereof, and will obey the laws thereof, and that I will in all respects, and that I will in all respects, uphold and enforce the provisions of the charter, uphold, uphold and, enforce and enforce the provisions of the charter, and ordinances of the city of Oxford, and ordinances of the city of Oxford, and will faithfully discharge the duties of the Board of Zoning Appeals. And will faithfully, faithfully discharge the duties of the Board of Zoning Appeals of the City of Oxford, upon which I am a member. Of the City of Oxford, upon which I am a member. May we sign it? Yes, you may. Thank you.
these documents go to? He's got a side. Of Notarize or? Thank you. All right, the next order of business is election of officers. So we need a nomination and second for chair, vice chair, and secretary. So why don't we start with chair? I would nominate you to be the chair. Keep room in here. Is there a second? I'll, I'll second. Uh, call a question. Call a question. Okay. All in favor? Aye. Aye. aye no. Signify aye or uh, all opposed or abstentions. Okay. Uh, nominations for vice chair. I nominate Phil Russo. I second. All in favor? Signify aye. 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 Opposed? Nay. Or abstentions? Alrighty. And secretary, which is a job that involves, we're not sure. I'm Making not sure. sure the minutes are correct. Making sure the minutes are correct. So it needs a good, someone who's a good reader for the secretary. I'll nominate Mr. Smith. Nominate Chad Smith. I'll second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Or abstentions? All right. And now we need approval of the November 28th, 2023 minutes of the regular meeting. That was the last time we met, was November 28th, 2023. Move the minutes. Move to approve the minutes. Second. Any uh, corrections or any corrections? Okay, uh, all in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed or abstentions? All right, thank you. New business. Zach, you wanna speak to us? Yes, to absolutely. Us. Thank you very much, Madam Chair. Um, so the case that we were planning for tonight was a variance at an alley lot behind 207 and 209 West Collins Street. And of course you received a full staff report in your packet for this evening. Um, as of yesterday morning, um, we've been notified that the desire from the applicant is to table the case to next month. Um, there are a couple different factors at play with this one. So just to provide a little bit of context for the group, um, so uh, I guess I'll, I'll start by noting that uh, just last week, I was at a uh, national planning conference in Minneapolis, uh, attending on behalf of the city. And so I was out the entire week for the conference plus um, some extended vacation time, road tripping, seeing cities and so forth. It's kind of my thing. Um, so before I left, I did inform the applicant that it was looking like we had a four member board in light of um, Roger's resignation. Um, at the time when I sent the email, April uh, 3rd, um, I had informed the applicant, of course there's an alley lot development moratorium that was adopted by council on April 2nd, um, which I think very much plays into this particular case and is evident through the staff report. Um, so I did offer some guidance at that time as far as you know, potential options that might exist um, in terms of how to proceed. Um, um, and, and let, let the applicant know that at that time, Roger had resigned in March. So we were looking at a four member board unless council had appointed a new member to the board on 16th, which of course they did. So welcome again, Mr. Wyatt. Um, so returning to the office earlier this week, um, I of course got the email Monday morning about um, the desire to, to, to table the case to next month thinking that there was still a four member board. So I did inform the applicant, well, as it turns out now we have five members, but I believe the applicant had talked to his client and, and probably reached the conclusion that um, they just wanted to delay to the, to the next month to, um, I don't want to speculate too much, obviously, because I'm not sure what exactly those conversations were, but um, 
so I, I'm not going to speculate as to what the strategy might be um, exactly, but um, all I know is that the desire at this point is to table to next month. It remains to be seen what becomes of this, if it ends up being withdrawn or if we end up proceeding. Um, speaking specifically to the alley development moratorium in particular, and this is all public knowledge, so this is not anything that would in essence be new for the group here this evening. Um, there are a lot of issues particular to alley development um, that have been known for quite some time. Um, issues related to access, drainage, utilities, visibility, and so forth. Um, development characteristics like setbacks, lot coverage, um, the list goes on and on. And so a lot of those issues we look to tackle um, within the six month moratorium period um, that we now have. So thankfully we had that temporary pause on alley development, we can reevaluate, we can work with our planning commission and council to put forward the legislative changes that would enable for a better, more cohesive development pattern um, on alley sites. And so that all kind of goes back to, again, this, this is very much, these are topics that are up in the air that um, still need to be nailed down through the legislative channels with planning commission and council. So it's hard to say at this point exactly what the um, outcome might be with respect to BZA and, and the board's jurisdiction in looking over variances, but of course we'll keep you up to date in terms of what further developments might transpire moving forward. So that's about all I'd have to share. I'm happy to take any questions from the board. Um, I just, uh, oh, sorry, I got one question then I'll call you Mr. Conrad. Um, so one idea, we can't count it, but one idea is that planning commission would take up a new zoning code for alleyways in the next few months. Correct, right? that's what okay. our intention is, yes. Okay. I would also add that there's there's more factors with beyond zoning um, that have been mentioned. Uh, so so there's we don't know if there's enough information that will come out that will be able to help the applicant understand whether they should withdraw or continue to get a decision because once the moratorium is over, if there's a decision that is in their favor, then they would be able to proceed. And if it's not, then maybe a code change would assist them. We don't know what the outcome would be. Ultimately, this this application for variance that's been submitted can't go unanswered indefinitely. It needs to either be withdrawn or decisions made. But um, we think it's perfectly reasonable to uh, to uh, respond positively to the request to table and and see what happens next month. And if there's not any, anything in definition, you know, if they want to postpone again, then we'll have to kind of reevaluate and um, have some kind of endpoint that makes sense. Uh, but for one month, given the fact that there was some, uh, it wasn't sure whether there would be a five member board or not, mm -hmm. um, and the moratorium is relatively new, it seems reasonable to, uh, to grant their request to, uh, to postpone. Since the applicant has requested that the proposal be tabled, I'll move that we table this application. Okay, motion, to, I'll second. Second. Did you have a question? Did you want to make a comment as well? No. No, okay. Okay, so um, motion uh, moved and second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions. Great. Okay, thank you. So I'm going to make a motion for an adjournment since we have no other business so for tonight. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed or abstentions? Thank you. All right. Thanks, you guys. I forget if I'm alive.